Well, I want to give a bit of uh, a bit of respect and pay a bit of a compliment to the Carlton Footy Club because what they had to go through coming into this game with the talent that was out, and specifically to the two leaders, but Patrick Cripps um, probably the most. I thought that his his game today, he just stood up for a football club. He's seasoned on the line, surrounded by youth and inexperience. He just said, "Not on my watch." And when they had to have it, it was Patrick Cripps in the middle that just destroyed them at clearance, destroyed them at contest. And they built an early lead to take away that nervousness that could have crept in on the road. Hostile crowd. Uh, they were playing for, for their own personal reasons. Uh, they were poor today, the Eagles. Yeah. But they were made to look second rate by one man wrecking ball in the middle of the ground. He was, he was awesome. He was exactly how you want your captain to play. Everywhere the ball went, he just out-muscled whoever was around him. I just thought the way that he played in the manner that he played. They were the third youngest uh, team of the round, Carlton. 11 guys with 45 games or less experience. Two debutants, a guy that had played one other game. And he just said, follow me, guys. Just, just let me do the heavy lifting here. He had guys hanging off him all day. He, he was unbelievable. 35 touches, 10 clearances, 8 uh, inside 50s, 12 score involvements. I, I thought he was terrific. And I just want to mention Wiedering because we're hard on Wiedering. He, he, was, he was the whole thing down back today. He rendered Oscar Allen useless. Which is what you wanted him to be, isn't it? Well, he was, he was more than just... He, he did more than just defeat a, a very good player. He'd come off his man like that here. I, I was wrapped for him to be able to do this. And I just think that maybe they saw some things today. Maybe they, they get some confidence out of this as a team with their ball use inside 50. It was lower, it was flatter. They scanned more. They just bombed him because Harry's down there. Or bombed him, as I say, that he bombs <laughs> yeah. that in. But you can see what Wiedering's doing. So this is, a, as a defender, the 12 intercepts, the 5 intercept marks, and still defeated uh, a star of the competition, Oscar Allen. So I, I think we have to go specifically to those two guys for saving a club. Enormous fallout. And significant turmoil for Michael Voss yep. and for, for the Carlton Football Club. And to further to your point, with this, 20 tackles inside 50, and they had 16 combined for the past three weeks. Uh, we saw Kemp kick the four. Moyer, one of the great first goals of all time. Lord, 15. Uh, tough, and Bins got better and better with 18 touches. So it was a pretty proud day at a boy at Michael Voss. Been a big week. Um, you know, from you know, taking stock, I guess, after the game last week and... Um, trying to count the bodies. Um, it was just a really hard week. Uh, I guess last week, what I did say was, we'll find out a little bit about us um, as, a, as a footy team and, and as a footy club. And um, I just thought the response was, was outstanding. It was a really well-connected performance. Um, didn't rely on one individual to get it done, although there was some individual outstanding performances. Um, but it took a squad. And when I mean it took a squad, it took the whole squad <laughs> to be able to get that one done.